start off. We do have 100 Thieves on attack here first. Is this oh. going to be their pick? Vanity playing a bit of the Viper tech now. He's able to hide in his own smoke, but for how long? It's about to go down. The jig is up, and he actually gets okay. a tag coming out of the Sova. He waits just long enough and gets himself to safety. What play by C9. Such a great start, too. At least we're able to get the wall up, the plant, but here comes a big Spike plank complete. And let's see if you can knock him down. Leaf with one. They're going to be looking for him now as he dashes forward to create a little more distraction. Boy, a nitro one coming around with the rise of class. Right clicks. And Woo! another one from Asuna with the cross. Let's see what they can do. Ooh. There Straight you go. up in. Leaf in the face of 100 Thieves. E tower. Few lineups for Vanity, so 100 Thieves know there's quite a few around them. Waiting on Hiko's sonar dart to come back up. So they're going to be playing pretty quiet here. C9 now on the retake. Nice. Kiko with those Guardian flicks. Finds Leaf. Gets a big frag to start off the retake for Cloud9. Poison's off. That's going to be a retake wall finally going up. Is there enough poison though? Vanity has just about five seconds left on this wall. Is able to use it for a bit of a distraction. The 3v3 as Zeta cleans up one more. The possibility keeps Enemy getting remaining. greater here, Vans. Asuna. Sitting high on pipes, drops for another location. No, you did not! You absolutely did not! He's gonna be able to get this one! Just enough. The defuse comes through, but it's not enough time. And Asuna is gonna get surrounded by Cloud9 Blue here after the plant goes down. How much damage can Boy do, though? Oh, no. He wants to get close. Nice block. Oh, they made it out, knowing they haven't gained enough ground. Beautifully done. The tag team effort by C9 to regain mid control. They only have two left. Leave ready for this fight. <laughs> How can I get close? Remaining. Tough to mess with Nitro. He'll be able to hit the shot there on the leaf. And Vanity won't have for some sprays just to make sure we're not pushing forward. But it's pushing forward at the bottom. And Asuna wins it versus Zeppa. Yeah, there's that Reina attack. Ethan drops leaf. And C9 is losing their footing very quick on this gun round when they hope to have at least a few frags to dictate what was going to happen. Three kills now at A site, and it's a full rotation for C9. They're always seeming to have to react. 100 Thieves is moving so quickly on this map. Mitch. Last player standing. Not detected just yet, but it doesn't matter. There's so many angles to but 100 Thieves evil kind of even feeling like the, the uh, pace of the game might change with how much money they had. Oh, Eco getting taken out. That is not going to be helpful for 100 Thieves. And Vanity takes down Nitro immediately. Oh my, the, the trades right now is the ops are going down. Leaves does not have the full pace anymore. 100 Thieves go back into attack mode. And Zeppa's on his own at the A site, so he's just gonna have to wait it out for his teammates to rethink this smart play to do. It started off well, but the Viper's pit comes out for the attacker side of 100 Thieves, and now they're gonna try to hold it. All right, Cloud9, need to do this. Zeppa with the start. The Empress looking to get crowned as she dives into the pit. Zeppa to look and make more chaos, and Zeta finishes off, boys. The Viper pit is down, the defuse will come up, and Cloud9 Blue are on the board. The communication is he pings him. Rotation from Cloud9 Blue. You're getting a little bit of Zeppa towards mid now, so they can start to cover their bases on each side. Here comes the plant that's going to be called your rotation fully coming in now. Zeta ready with a no one as he was getting prepared to peek and gets the shot first onto Ethan. They're going to take their time. They know they have the upper hand. Spike hasn't even been planted, it looks like it, but you still got 35 seconds on the clock, and now it's a pressure game here for Hiko and Asuna. He's going to have 26 seconds before he can get his sonar bolt up. And he gets spammed through as well from the top side, just over the wall. 25 seconds. Asuna knows he needs to force the situation. And he's going to go far side yellow. He's got three that could peek him from different angles. Right in front, sees one, gets the next two. As Hiko trades, it's not going to be enough time, Vans. There's just two. For a retake, as you see, he places it on the ground uh, inside B. Just to deny that, and here's the fight at A main. That's fight. Oh. Or they're still bringing it in your face instead to say, hey, 100 Thieves, you're doing that, we can do the same thing. And this time, yep. we're talking about this mirror to mirror, and unfortunately, Asuna punishes Leaf, and that's going to be the A site weakened, but there's still two players there to hold it out on the high low angle. Yeah, Leaf really caught in the situation there. Nitro taking control of 410 now. Who's going to be paying rent? And it looks like it's 100 Thieves that's going to have to lay it down. You go Nitro, to be pulling it back in their favor, though. Oh, that's going to be tough. Always tough when you can get that pinch on the wall. You cannot pen with the daggers of Bladestorm.
Oh, oh no reset, Nitro goes for the play! Here you go. Going on. Zeppa tries to push up, so Zeppa's push was from A main, then from mid. They're trying to vary it up to see if they can figure out things on 100 Thieves, but again, once Thief has that off money, I think you can expect 100 Thieves to play more passive. Oh, nice kills by boy. So the Ooh. call was there, trying to push down towards this mid side just to counteract on this lurk that could happen. You're playing it passively to troll oh, around, and boy, gets a triple kill with that. Might have gone down first last round, but making up for it on this one. Leaf in the same spot, does find the shot now. Spam comes in, Asuna once again. His Indiana Jones cosplay oh as he flies across the rope. We are pretty much close to Halloween here, Rev. I mean, it is <laughs> Might as well just play the game, and Vanity, though, evens it up on a 1v1 with the rotate, so this is decent. Both of them have full HP on either end for Hiko and Vanity, but you mentioned this Hunter's Fury. He can play it so passively for Hiko right now and just play that clock. Oh, the dink. As he went back behind the wall, he took the 144 shot. He knows he's close now, he can hear it. Hiko trying to get the peek. Vanity actually has the angle! Vanity has the angle! Hiko has the clap. Nitro is looking for a quick clip! Zeta coming up huge! You said it! The darts, the shots, he's been able to hit them all, and he has been such a big fragger for C9 Blue. Oh my, it's a passive A play for the defenders of Cloud9 Blue, so an easier take for 100 Thieves into the site, and we're doing that same plan once again. They love this plan so far for 100 Thieves. They do. The, the idea of to, to, to protect it makes it so hard, because you need to fight everything on the floor first before you can take a fight on an elevated level. And then you gotta they fight use, it makes so tough. It makes it so tough. You does so many things on your plate here. Cloud9 shouldn't be able to do this. They've already got two. The ultimate now coming through from Zeta C9. Now the possibility of doing this. Get themselves back into the site, and that's going to be it. Hiko may not have the time. Does he have the lineup? That's going to be right in. That's going to be Zeta on the defuse. There's no leaf on the defuse. Oh, my God. He gets back up. Zeta looking for it. And they protocol right now. Their retakes have really brought back a lot of rounds. 100 Thieves will get themselves into site. Leaf again. Not finding too many on the daggers. And it looks like he'll know. Hiko will alert the team. There's two already on the flank. The duelists are there. And that's going to be tough. Boy takes one down before Zeppa trades it back. And they throw Zeppa here. Oh. He's going to get a quick one heal. Enemy. That's Empress on. Hiko with the insta trade. Eight to four. Left on the clock. I like the mid pressure from both teams, right? Because you have to consider they can still hit both sites. Where's the majority of their players? Now I think that is more privy and known to both teams as they can hear the flying of Leaf inside site and Hiko will call just in hell. The rotation come through here for Boy. No, they're all going to be coming from the top oh! of the site. Boy may be a little late, so 100 Thieves are trying to man down, but it one still works. Remaining. Boy's trading one. Now up against Zeta. Can the new member of 100 Thieves make it happen? Oh, he goes for the util use to time. So they're getting themselves some they all points. It. Big dart going in over towards the A site screens. What in the world? <laughs> yeah. They oh my word, you, got, you love to see it. <laughs> we tried to uh, to ping to make sure that we could clear out Austin on the top of screens, and then that wall funnels the uh, combat blue, but here's the blank from Vanity, though. That's actually really nice to even things up in the 4v4. Oof. Boy. Closing down Kitchen as Zephyr trades into sight. Empress out now, and they have to consider... Boy, or I'm sorry, Azepa has the sight, and that's where the rest of C9 is going to be moving. Empress on both sides, but Zeta drops wow. Asuna right away. No heal to come through for him, and it makes it much tougher for 100 Thieves now to get back and, and get this retake. Yeah, so it's kind of split up on this retake, though. Boys inside defender spawn. You have a flank yeah. from Nitro from attacker spawn. A 1v1 from Zeta who's been on point with the laser beam of the Spectre long range, but they cross through each Last other. They, they have no standing. idea. Ships in the night. Does he turn? Hello. Ooh. They could chase, they could, but Nitro really made it away quick enough. And just to take a couple of steps back, uh, we were talking about that wall setup. 
from what I force Ethan away from his position towards A, and Ock comes right back out for Nitro into this round, and that is going to be retaliated by Zed on top of Belt. You will so lots of players still able to opt here on the attacker side, and we're using that for Zeta so that Leaf, when you're Sova's yeah. looking for mid control, and that's just going to be Leaf instead with the Phantom to drop another of 100 Thieves into the A site. So that's only he on his own. It's going to be potentially a super late hit into the A site, but the rotation comes out for 100 Thieves. You still have a lurk from Vanity. You're waiting for Vanity left. to just get towards the boiler side, then you hit in, then you have a late flank from, from, from Vanity. Sorry. A lot of respect being given this round, even though a few members are down, executing it. 20 seconds left in the round. Cloud9 trying to add some extra pressure to the atmosphere. Shot spawn side. So after a couple of seconds ticking, no more leers left for Azepa to try to peek back towards the screens, but they're still going to try to look for these kills. Boy. Uno mas. One enemy remaining. Oh, I was like, wait, he did? Uh, he go just behind him. Able to help clean him up over the shoulder. Boys Pit is up. They'll be able to use that next round. The operator stays cycling here for Cloud9. You pointed and go. Utilities being used. There's an up the gut ult used actually as the trigger goes off. Leaf's able to follow up with a kill there. Maybe the second one is screens. And Zeppa comes up with a kill onto Asana. The rain of re random matchup continues. Zeppa with another. Can he pick up a third on the round? He rips up the Empress. And now they are going Woo. to be not confident about it. All the way towards that screen side because the rest of Cloud9 yep. Blue just pushed down towards that left side main. Has been in tube a few times going into kitchen. Seppa to open up the round as Nitro answers back. That's a necessary frag. And I wondered where Sage would be. I wondered where Ethan would be here on this round. It's a partial buy, but they God. need to get anybody back up on their feet. And Austin is going to help 100 Thieves out a little by making it a 5v3. So you saw Asuna, you saw the res, and also a kill towards A side. You know now that the B side is open for business, and we get a flat here for Kitchen and for Mid. So this is going to have to be the most important hold for Vanity inside this Kitchen area. And he They're able to, it. They're able to grab some weapons now. We tend to die. Ethan now onto a Vandal, Mitch. Dropping down Asuna. Oh, I like this. The wall to That's funnel it out. Angle. Yeah, he's got exactly. Oh. Never expects the second one. Think ours this time. The tip of the spear. They're going to try to get a quick plant down. And, and oh. the rest of C9 are going to disperse. Zeppa, another first blood. It's incredible how quickly he can get into a position to take down 100 Thieves. Oh, he's in a great spot here. The late six out. retake. Ethan, Asuna. Beautiful work as they work as a team to get themselves back into the site. Most of the members, 100 Thieves, or C9, sorry, are funneled towards the that B main area. And now with the it. flank. He's not going to know at first. They're all actually hiding angles right now. And it's going to take him a bit to get up there. There's the first drag for him, and he's got him on the fence. Vanity goes down. And they are going to be able to get right through this. Heading towards his generator, <laughs> and that's Zeppa. So we're just going to try to clear him out. You will not. Oh, it still got him! Oh it got a ping off! The travel time for the Cloudburst did not do Nitro any good there, and Vanity will take down Ethan as well. This is going to be 100 Thieves falling apart in the site when they had the angles held, but C9 Blue's utility was just too good. The utility, the res, and now you're just trying left. to focus a little bit on how you get these picks, and unfortunately, as you mentioned here, Riv, just a nice, still be pretty good. So they want to keep it low against out Cloud9, and Vanity will not allow that to happen. A full presence of day. Quickly going in. Yeah, all the blinds, all the, the leers coming through, just deafening the action of what's happening, but we can still see it on our screens. 100 Thieves making left. a very good case for keeping themselves in this game of the series. 5v3 as it comes to... Oh, the oh my god, shot. boy takes a shot, but Seda hits it just through the ramp! Boy's alive, he creates more pressure on the backside, and now there's much more that C9 have to worry about in terms of angles. Mitch trying to finalize it. Nico uses that time to make sure they can find Vanity. They have to smother him. There's enough time to 
just creep in, but they still have to find it. Oh. That's a right click that misses. I think it drew Vanity on the wall, to be Snake honest. Defuse goes down. Oh. Snake bite goes out. Vanity! Oh, he almost gets the play of the day, but it's not going to be enough. That's a half See? defuse. Big half defuse by Ethan and Nitro. Taking A strat, he's going to be there, but still on the flank. Oh, defense set up from C9 Blue, the post plant now. They're, they're planning the same way for 100 Thieves, uh, that 100 Thieves did on the attack, so let's see what happens with this. Biggest kill that has to come back from Nitro. Leaf looking for that res the whole time. He was staring at it from his perch on 410. Zeta waiting, does not want to be timed here by Nitro. Looks like God, he gets him, but Nitro dashes into his own smoke to find out who the flank would be. What? What a smart bait play. You had time to hit it as a five-man group inside the A-side. Then finally has it a watch flank again. And here comes Seppa trying to get first blood. That's such an interesting shot when people are flying over your head, but also peeking you low. No more. Difficult one and done in the corner there for C9 members. Eight and four. Cloud9 having some impeccable retakes. Is this going to be one of those? There's Zeta turning on the shock dart damage. It helps with the finish from Vanity. Oh. Vanity with the spray towards pipes. What control? Hiko ready for the shock dart. Remember, Hockey's. how often do they plan here? Every time. One you don't have to ask. Last That's going to be a shot. Standing. They were able to clean this up. But is it going to be the same this time? I think Hiko may be able to clutch this one, but Zeta with the first shot, it's not a half just yet. Hiko peeks in, Zeta just misses the shot. Very nice 2v2, and my apologies at the beginning of the round when I said it was C9 putting some pressure into this B side with the Aldron. It was definitely Hunter Thieves, so Hunter uh -huh. Thieves stays true. I know I did. Asuna still to get that first shot in to make sure he's still in the face. Of course he went back into the fight. You know this guy. He's going to need a heal. Ethan just does that, jumps up to make sure he's nice and healthy. The peak coming from Ethan. He catches Zeta looking left, and Asa's going to retrain back. Another one. This could be 100 Thieves finalizing ice boxes. They gave so many rounds back to Cloud9. Shortening up the utility usage. A quick B hit. Plant down. Wow, Nitro and the Suna coming up with two quick kills on this one, and things take a bit of a pause. We've got a few there. That strat kind of... Reminiscent of the Sentinel's fast B plant and just dip out. Oh, classic trades. Mitch comes up big. They're going to be able to come out. No way. That's so another frag. Good. 100 thieves are so efficient so far for the squad, really being able to gain space. And now it's another retake, fans. It seems like that's what we got for our first three rounds. Does this one come up in favor of 100 thieves, though? You're committing to this, right? It's a 5v5. They got rifles for 100 thieves. Vanity with one. Oh, Leaf double spray down. Remaining. Gets the dash. Seppa with the finalizer on to Hiko. And now Nitro is left wondering. There have been falters. You can't see there haven't. That's the advantages that your opponent is going to take home Hiko in a first blood situation. But he actually is put in one there and is able to come up big. Usually last alive to make sure his darts can do big work. Oh, he gets sucked in, but he still has the shot. Hiko, a little bit of an left. acrobatic work right there, tries to get himself into a safe situation with the team. Trolling, and there's the Kalad he was Lights looking for. A 4K okay. for Hiko. He got his. And now, can it Mitch to clutch the round for his squad as he comes back in oh. to clean up the final kill? Boy ready, boy with the dink. Mitch on 10 HP, and boy's gonna get the spam once again. Round by 100 thieves. But C9 still in the lead, still have the money momentum. You can see Thieves with a few specters here trying to clear the site together. Spike down. Oh my word. Huge. I mean, Cloud9 did not really get in more than a few steps on each one of those, seeing if that Hunter's Fury would do much from Hiko. Zeta could actually have one of his own, but he gets taken down. Not making this easy. They have all the utility to make him squirm. Trying to get the 1v1s. Well, I thought it was going to be Zeppa first, but it's Leaf. Oh, they see him. They know he's trying to get out of that situation, so they're able to tag him. What control over the sight of C while not even really being in it. Nicely done by Cloud9 to start this one off and have Nitro on the bench. Plus, oh, all five alts used. <laughs> one more on this retake, and should they wait for this? Will they wait for this? There you go. It's now up. Asuna, one. Nice crossfire from Vanity in the rest of scene behind as Hiko looks to come in. They are splitting this into one, two. And they're going to have to push the rest of the members of C9 out. Look at this. 2 HP for Vanity. A great tag, but no defuse coming through just yet. The time is dwindling down, and it looks like this is going to be the round. Oh. In for C9 as the diffuser is killed.
The shock dart comes through from Zeta. We've seen it so... Oh, because we need them a little bit more as it seems like they can't get a pin on C9 strats. Oh, up and over. We've seen Asuna awesome do that a few times in this tournament in the LCQ to start and get the round in 100 Thieves' favor. Baits out Zeppa. Because you cannot wall pen with those daggers. He does get the frag in the no face, right into the face of Zayden. Now he's able to get another one, but Mitch drops him. Mitch with a 3k. Mitch with a possible 4, but then he gets that one. They go for the full house. I don't know how many times 100 Thieves can get those kind of rounds to go in their favor, Van Zeppa coming up top. He tries to play the elevation. We heard about Ender talking that on the analyst desk. How it's always going to be a shit is up. Those have been so important. Oh no. For 100 Thieves. Ethan and boy, what? By Ethan, Mitch looking to re-clear sewers if he can. Gets to the line here by Asuna as Vanity is stuck <laughs> between a rock and a hard place. Right in the chest. Oh uh, my word, you're discussing Asuna, but can he finish their job? He cannot leave fearless with the operator. Bullet stuck in his arm, comes out with the blade storm now, and he'll try to close the gap. Flank to flank. Here, here's the ultimate we're goal. I don't think he's going to leave that area, will he? There's another flank on the flank! Exactly. Oh, always don't forget to check your flank when you're flanking. <laughs> Zeppa, it's in the corner. Oh he was my. stuck in that spot. That was going to be tough in 100 Ds. Making a very good case to retake this site. Wall's about to drop as they're hearing this one for a while now. And it is on the other side, Astra. Oh, oh my God, God. what? Vanity. They can, they're going to win this round. He's going to be able to play the time. Hiko's going to have to work a miracle here to be able to get this one. And Cloud9. How far will he go? Ooh, okay. He's going to take this a little more patient. <gasps> Astro. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, he does finally get him. And he gets a dink on the way out. So he goes real worse off after he's that encounter. And it's going to be the B strat. We're seeing a replication Dr of the first Dr round. But they're going BA. Does it work? It's the fight in the cloud burst. And Austin comes up big as Vanity trades one back. It's now a lot of classics here for this end fight in B. The right one HP. Beware. Oh, another shock dart coming through. It's not going to take him down, though. Ethan will, left. with how deadly One he's been now. Remaining. He ain't just planting anymore after the first time. Leaf with a 4K coming up on that. Information. They're going to hear footsteps up there. That's big. He doesn't know somebody's just on his Ooh. back, and they may have eyes on the spike. He go down low. Mitch finding the spam for the wall. That's going to be a great trace on that. The tracking coming in from us on boy as well, but he still has a couple of stars. He can disrupt a bit left. if he can, Last and they have to work these tricks. Okay, never mind. Popped in the face by a nice guardian that was left behind here by Hiko. Boy with 8 HP is gonna get yep. knocked down, so nine. Don't they wall bang each other? Leave for Asana. The push up! Zeppa! This is garage side, so now you know the split's coming on C. Spike oh. down, C. Dark comes in, maybe a little late, but they do get the payoff of taking down Mitch there. Nitro goes through, oh, thinks he finished the first kill, but does finalize wow. it on the double take. Great use of the sky utility. Leaf, a reset. Spike planted. 2v1. He does have an updraft. He has full Defy utility for this. That's another one. He's going to be able to defuse from the side. A little cheeky defuse on, maybe. Playing the Cypher Gate. Gets himself up for a bit of damage, but he's still pretty healthy. They're just about the same HP there right now. Oh my word. <laughs> you put Zeta into the mix now. Try one to split up towards Garage and Long yeah. Zeta to hold, which is why 100 Ds, they're looking to push back towards Garage and re push uh, into that spot. I love the use of this. It really separates them trying to get into the site or forces Cloud9 to go through the Killjoy Ultimate so they can pressure into it. Makes it tough for him. One got locked Cloud down. Nine doing what they can. One did and definitely a D get locked down. Remaining. Shock darts. Nitro. Oh, oh my word. They covered it well. They're able to backpedal a lot of that. Oh my god. Mitch on a mission. Oh. He did not I expect to see exactly that many members way. coming through the garage area. Oh no way. How many can he lay down? Zeta actually stays to try and get more than one. Austin almost able to clean up vanity here as the site is once again taken by 100 thieves. Leaf, Leaf, ready to take these 1v1 missions all by himself. He'll head into the site. They still have to wait for one to come around. Zeppa's not too far behind now, Vans, and this is going to be a tall task to ask. The HP's there. It could be in their favor. Nah, Hunter's Fury. Long range Hunter's Fury. Oh, they do hit him. I was going to say Hunter's Fury as well was pretty early about now losing these pulse plant battles. And Zeta just grabbed his ultimate at long. He's going to be rushing on the side of Cloud9 from A to C now. Leaf finds Ethan and potentially some help from a rotate. 
This round is coming down to the utility and frags because so far Cloud9 has read the play. Oh! Like the they are just going to explode a double blast pack kill. You're kidding me. Austin on two. He can be flicking these down left and right, but it's not going to be enough. Literally an explosive round with that satchel charge kill. Riv, I haven't seen any satchel charge kill since like beta days when it was doing like... All right, Asuna somehow getting away from that one in 100 Thieves to bring it to 1210 here. They have a great setup, but you see nine retakes have been powerful. Pico or Nitro is pretty far back watching the flank. He goes also. And most of the members of C9 are not going to be coming through that spawn area, so they have to funnel through. They're going to have to go oh, down. Drop through, leaf through the air, is able to float down and get one. Zeppa cleans another one up. How does this always happen for C9? The Zeta with another one, and he goes left by himself in the corner of Long A. Shock one dart. Shock Dark gives up his position. A second one would do it, and he can't transfer quick. These, the understand his rotation's coming back towards A, and they have a three-player stack. Leaf takes a bit of damage. They know they're not going up against a drone now with what Leaf saw in mid. Remember coming in. C9 ready and waiting. Oh, the first one from Asuna Hiko. They're getting close enough to make it count here. Vanity in a spot where he's touched many around. And the first one's going to be true for him with the classic. Just by Bricks is another member. And Asuna is going to be able to pick up one. Oh, Mitch, make it count. He does find Asuna. And now they can play the game, but it's going to be safe. Uh, and with an owl drone. They're going to try to sell a fake here towards B. Yeah, the intention... Oh, oh, that's not what they wanted. I was going to say the intention of a wall coming up from that angle that fast with the drone is a big trigger that something's going to happen at B, but 100 Thieves are still anchoring each site, Vans. They are not fooled on this one just yet. Oh, so, helping out Asuna there as he almost goes down blind and dead to rights. Zeta drops Ethan. And they get down to a 3v2. Very low HP. Even lower now as 100 Thieves will fight them. The recognizing Phantom or Vandal in that situation becomes even more of a key factor just on the other side of the wall. I can't believe they didn't hear him yet. We've seen so many kills happen in this situation, and Leaf waits for Boy to run through. Also took a bit of damage from that wall not being his. Asuna in and out to play a little game of cat and mouse here. Who can he find next? Spike planted. All of C9 is so spread out right now. I feel like 100 Thieves has so many things to think about. What, what kind of round is this? Oh my word. Nobody's watching mid. This is so interesting here for, for 100 Thieves. Ooh, leaf trade. Finds Ethan. The flash comes through. Look at the teamwork and the execution right now from the squad of Cloud9. 100 Thieves here now on their chance for a retake. The operator's going to make it a little bit more tough with that Viper's pick. No more shots. No shock darts available. Yeah, I was looking at that too. As soon as, soon as people are hiding next to each other at the yep. back side of B, you're like, shock dart, have it, baby. Leaf with three. A fourth coming up, possibly in the ace in his eyes, and it's going to be his peak. Austin grabs one, can't get the dismiss in in time, and now it's up to Hiko. 10 HP. He walks into the Viper's bite and sneezes, and he'll basically die here. A nice finalize on that kill. What? He heard the footsteps coming out. He plays. Yeah, you have the Vipers pit over at B, as we said. Oh, my. Oh, Asuna goes down? What? They're just able to start taking them away. The patience of Cloud9, and they all activated this. To invest in. Uh, even Mitch now. Right. Nitro's tall lead. On the, on the right side of Halls, he, he dashes across and eventually pulls up the frag from playing the patience game on AK. And this round is now what we're watching. I thought Leaf was going to get enough. Yeah, take care of him that way. This all happened towards off camera, but I'll have to recheck that. Oh. Nitro. Deja vu. This is how he came online last time as well to make the comeback versus ascend in Berlin. Will it happen here? It's going to be a tough one. Yep. Three for Nitro. Off the rip with the blade storm. Mitch comes flying out of the... Again, they have to work against that economy on the side of C9. Asuna drops Empress. And Once it gets planted. So now yeah. that it goes yeah. down, you have Mitch that could potentially get a lurk kill. It happens in this battle right now and a neural step after. Throw the hat. Spot Hiko in the back. Does he play it? Enemy oh, get the jump on Hiko. Mitch says this hall is mine. And Nitro was ready for that. He's going to get focused here. Nitro with another quick flick. Can he make him more when these crosses happen, right? So Ethan pushed forward and Mitch gets punished. Does he have the entry? Boy, with a huge opening frag from the young player on 100 deep. 
Vanity's in sight though. They look over towards Arches and that can be Zoe going down. Oh, he's getting caught with that util at the last moment, unfortunately. And Vanity makes it true once again. Scared about when that ping comes through if you're sitting in the spot that's not spammable. Asuna will find one. Jumps into the middle of the two, trying to divide them. And it's only going to be a little bit of work needed by Ethan. He picks up the 3k. They are anchoring yeah. both sides hard. The duelist will be the ones to come back. Oh! Sight take. And Leaf says, this is mine right away. Misses the rest. He's going to get the Phantom out and finds that after the flash coming through from Zeppa over the shoulder of the take of Cloud9. That's not the first time we've seen that. Well, Mitch on the lurk play again, just trying to run down that clock this time. 1v1 against Asuna. Asuna can now reheal. Okay, it's something we usually don't see. They've already grabbed a weapon, but he's going to try to make it happen. Dash. That's the first. Does he get the Vandal? Oh, just a shot over the shoulder, and now he's going to look for the second gun. Picks that Vandal up, no up and he gets ready. Him and Hiko in the sight. Zeta now looking up. He's going to get for the spam. Just to the right. He's not finding it. That's the whiff. That's Asuna. That's a 3k and 8. Ready to go in. They have the wall. Like I said, this is a lot about retakes. That's what Breeze is about. Once the wall goes down, you can't be caught with your pants down. The wall's still up. So that's when Cloud9 goes through. Expect the unexpected here on the pistol round of second half. And Nitro using one of those ghosts I was talking about. Keeping rain. But holy moly. He's got three heads to find here on the side of Cloud9. And it looks like they may be able to pinch him down with a quick rotation out of this. Everybody looking the same left. way. Mitch changes that quickly as he looks right to Tetris. That will here. So this is what 100 Thieves have done before. The shock dart with the snake bite. And this time it's going to be C9 doing the oh, same gosh. thing. Early halls control. Hello. Hello. So the rotation slowly coming out back towards B. They know nine. Nobody's backside. They actually get the camera right away. So he'll be able to turn it on and get some pings. I don't know if he'll go for the full dart until they get the retake, but he's still there. Misses the first one, so he's just like, hey, screw it. They don't know I'm here. That's a tag out coming in. Zeta with a great sonar bolt there. How much can Cloud9 use this? Ethan and Hiko trying to make it a null effect, but it is Zeppa that's left. And he double dinks Hiko for the 4K on the round. Both players holding it either, giving their energy. We'll see how far this one can go. Leaf and Zeppa. Difficult uh, for Mitch. He's, he's just going to have to really land this here with the camera. They know Cypher's backside. Camera. Oh, he missed. This on the right. Can he get it? Ooh. Leaf does take down Nitro there. This is going to be a tough 100. Thieves get themselves in, and now it's up to Hiko. 3v1 for him. The spike is not near him. Far side of the pillar, fully in the control of Cloud9. End point. Grand final point here for Cloud9, but this is this story's not over. It's still 100 Thieves on Breeze. It's still 100 Thieves. The come Leaf is pushed up again at a different spot. Here's the rotate. Oh, Asuna wins it. They are out to the right side, just above both walls, Welcome so you can make sure he's world. in. That's the Viper's Pit. There's still ultimates to be used. Eco got his. Asuna's is up here if he wants to rip off the Empress, but they do not need it at this point. 30 Here's seconds the 4v4, left. Vans. We talked about the retakes. It's where Cloud9 has been so strong, and 100 Thieves has a good amount of time here. They just need to get it down. 45 seconds once it is. Still have a recon dart. Actually got used now, just now. Mitch on a big flank. Double flank. Hiko watching the flank first. He'll be first contact. Oh. He looks away! Zeppa gets Asuna! They're second guessing their angles! It's not working as Boy comes up with a big frag. It's up to him, the newest member of the team. Can he keep this series alive? Boy staying in the- Oh! Office. He gets hit by Zeppa! That's gonna be the defuse. There's more than enough time, Cloud9.